Hi, it's uh, Alistair Byer from Bayer Crop Science. We're here today at a secure trial in Ballyang between Geelong and Bacchus Marsh. First of all, we'll have a look at the untreated plot where we've got a very heavy population of annual ryegrass in the Bolac wheat. Um, annual ryegrass is a big problem in this area and this would be yield detrimental for this wheat crop. And you can see the annual ryegrass here and the very heavy populations. So what we have here is the trifluralin treatment where we've put out 1.5 litres of trifluralin and incorporate it by sowing. And as you can see, the ryegrass plants are, are coming through the treatment. We're probably now about three and a half months into the, uh, into the trial and the trifluralin has lost its uh, residual control and we're seeing excessive ryegrass plants come through. This treatment is unsatisfactory and it's got um, too much ryegrass in it and this will be yield penalising in this treatment. So what we have here is the box of gold treatment. Box of gold applied at 2.5 litres of the hectare and incorporated by sowing. And we're roughly three and a half months after application of the box of gold. And the residual of the box of gold has well and truly run out here. And what we're seeing because of that is escape ryegrass plants that are now probably four and five tillers large and there's big populations of them. So the box of gold treatment here is um, not as good as the Secura and ryegrass population is getting away. So what we've got here is the Secura treatment. So it's applied at 118 grams to the hectare, which is the label rate, and incorporated by sowing with knife points and press wheels. And this is three and a half months after application. So still very, very good ryegrass control. We are starting to get, just starting to get the emergence of some small ryegrass. But as you can see on the ryegrass tips, the ryegrass is taking up the Secura through the roots. And the visual effect you see is that tipping and that ryegrass plant there will die. And there's another one just here that's showing very similar symptoms. So all in all, an excellent, an excellent result from the Secura and the farmer is very happy with this treatment. I think it being very useful within the cereals. It'll just break up that uh, chemical rotation, not having to be so reliant on your group A's and B's. And uh, obviously that's becoming a big problem with the uh, resistance in ryegrass. And if Secura can break that, uh, that rotation, I think that'll be an excellent fit. Yes, yeah, Secura, looking at it today, it's uh, providing a really good resistance management tool for farmers. It's uh, providing good control of ryegrass and offering an opportunity to get uh, control of ryegrass where by itself trifluralin would struggle. So it's a great opportunity for farmers to get resistance management tools in their belt and using them well in the paddock. I think one of the benefits I can see is the 14 day window you've got between spraying and then when you have to work it in for sowing. Logistically for us that'll be a fantastic benefit because uh, we've got the one tractor and a little sprayer and so having that big break is uh, going to be very beneficial. And also the uh, wash down effect into the furrow, as with Trefland it just sort of sits, gets quite tied up on particularly straw or other residue within the crop in the ground and uh, having that running back into the furrow will take care of the uh, ryegrass coming up and competing with the emergent seedlings.